Thanks a lot, Clayton. Well, we love our furry friends, our dogs, and we want them to go with us everywhere, especially when we're traveling, but planning for them to come along can be very difficult and stressful. One study shows 64% of pet owners feel uneasy when they make travel accommodations for their pets. So today, we're going to put your mind at ease with a few services that will help you with your travel plans with your pets, and it will make it a whole lot easier. So joining us is the founder of DogVacay.com, Aaron Hershorn, and he brought along five of his furry friends. Hey, Aaron. Hi, how are you? Thanks for having uh, me. Thanks for being here. What does Dog Vacay do? So Dog Vacay is an alternative to, to leaving your dog in a kennel. We have thousands of hosts across the country who watch the dogs in their own home, like a member of the family. And we're all about peace of mind. We have 24-7 customer support, insurance, and you get photos of your dog every day enjoying his own vacation. That is so cool. Yeah, so you, of you. course, vet the host family. We have a five-step vetting process, comprehensive insurance. It really is about trust and peace of mind. And these are some of your hosts, and they are, obviously, their dogs look very happy. These five dogs are just chilling on our plaza, and exactly. they do it out of the goodness of their heart. But they also do it because financially it makes sense. Yeah, our hosts are from all walks of life. We have stay-at-home moms, retirees, um, and example like Mike was able to quit his job as a software developer and watch dogs full time. How no much way. money can you make? Well, everyone sets their own rates. It tends to be about half the price of a kennel, but it averages kennels about. Kennels are expensive. Kennels are very expensive, yes. depending on the city. It could be twenty-five, thirty dollars a night on average for DogVacay.com compared to kennels, fifty, sixty, seventy dollars or a hundred. Yeah. So My wife and I started the company when we had this experience of leaving our dogs in a cage at the kennel, and it was, you know, it was like seventy dollars per dog and they're in a cage all day. It's not a good experience, and we felt awful. Well, that's one yeah. of the things that, that attends leaving your dogs is guilt. Exactly. And you're wondering what the dogs are doing. Are they being treated well? What are the dogs doing when they're with a host family? So we've done the survey, and we find that 50% of, of pet owners say that they travel less because of their dog or cat, and even a whopping 15% admit to having smuggled a dog onto a flight or a hotel that wasn't packed. There are a lot of dog smugglers yeah. out there. Yeah, exactly. And we support them. <laughs> so there are other websites that you say can also make people feel better about traveling. Oh, PetsWelcome.com? Yeah, PetsWelcome is great. If you want to go bring your dog to a hotel, they list all the different hotels and the various surcharges. Pet Flight is great. If you do need to travel with your dog on an airline, Pet Flight lists all the different restrictions that the airlines can have. There are even certain no-breathe no fly list for certain breeds. Is that I know. Right? Yeah. It's a shame. It is a shame. And our survey showed that 75% of pet travelers don't trust the airlines at all to care for yeah. their pets. And that's yeah, and that's a low number. Can you just Absolutely. really quickly introduce us to some of your friends? Yeah, so, so we've got Luca, the, uh, the beautiful Rottweiler here. Nice. We've got oh. Benny the Shih Tzu hiding behind. Toby over here. And uh, Benny the Puggle. And this is Hobbs. So these Beautiful are not pets. your dogs. These are other people's dogs you're taking care of. Do they know that they're on television? Yeah, they're on national TV. <laughs> yeah. They're famous. They're so if you drop your dog off at Dog Vacay, he, he can wind up on a morning show. Is what you're Absolutely. Right. It, anything could happen with Dog Vacay. <laughs> and look at all the friends they're yeah. making. We even saw a budding romance earlier during the commercial exactly. break. <laughs> what we do say is, you know, while airlines won't take certain dogs, hotels won't take dogs above a certain size, Dog Vacay welcomes all breeds from the teacup Yorkie to the Great Dane, even pit bulls. We're welcoming. We believe that every every dog deserves. I have vacay. never met a pit bull I didn't like, despite <laughs> their reputation. Go. They're sweet dogs. Uh, Aaron Hirschhorn, thanks so much. Everybody, check out DogVacay.com. Thank you Great so much. Great stuff. Thanks so much. Okay.